Hey, sports fans, Coach Nick here, and we have Wes Matthews. I grew up watching your dad play, so it's exciting to have you here. Let's talk shooting for a second here. Um, are you a hop guy or a one-two? I'm a one-two guy. I don't really do too much hopping. Okay, is there a reason for that? You know, I actually did hop when I was in high school, but my college coach, Tom Cream, my first, my first three years, you know, he really um, hammered home the one-two. Um, you know, it was more effective, it was, it was quicker, it was faster, and you minimize your travels doing that. Now, we talk a little bit about a new thing called the turn, where you're not ten toes to the rim. You have your toes turned a little bit to get your elbow in. Do you recognize that kind of fundamental? Uh, yeah, I, don't, I wouldn't say that I'm your, your textbook shooter. Um, sometimes my shoulders aren't squared. Sometimes I'm not on balance. Um, but it, for the most part, when I shoot, right before that ball is let go, I'm, I'm, my eyes are at the rim. I, I'm locked into the rim, and my arm or my uh, my upper body is, is squared to the basket. Uh, I don't think I shoot many shots when my toes facing the rim. Right. Okay. So you feel like there's 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 a notion of there's a slight bit of a turn to get your elbow in and your your wrist in, in line. Yeah. I mean, whatever's most comfortable for you. Yeah. Uh, and then how about the dip? When you catch the ball, do you bring it down or do you go straight up when you catch it? You know, it depends on the shot. Sometimes if you have a lot of, if you have a lot of time, you know, you, you, you dip it and, and, and get in your rhythm as if you're just catching and shooting with no one around you. But um, you have to adjust if there's the, the, the shot clock and, and the speed of the shot that you got to get off. And then lastly, when you release the ball, we call it the sway, where you let your feet flow forward, almost kind of like you're jumping forward. Uh, you do that. I don't know, are you aware that you do that? I'm not aware. I know I do it more often when um, when I'm running into the shot. Mm -hmm. um, if I'm more under, if I'm under more duress, um, and I elevate a little bit more, I'll jump a little forward. But for the most part, you know, I, I stay pretty close to the ground and, mm -hmm. and try to get my shot off quicker. Terrific. Well, thanks so much. Lots of great information there, and uh, we'll keep working these fundamentals. And good luck tonight. All right, thank you.